Hi everyone. In this video, we are going to learn two reactions. That is reaction of phenol with acetyl chloride and the next reaction is the reaction of phenol with benzoyl chloride. First, we shall learn the reaction of phenol with acetyl chloride. Okay. C6H5OH is phenol. What is the formula for acetyl chloride? CH3COCl. Okay. For our convenience, we are writing as like this. CH3COCl. CH3. Okay. Now we are going to react it with in presence of sodium hydroxide and pyridine. What happens? This hydrogen and this chlorine will leave as hydrogen chloride. The remaining thing will be united together. C6H5O C double bond O CH3. What is the name of this compound? The name of this compound is acet phenyl acetate. The name of this compound is phenyl acetate. This is an ester. This is an ester. So phenyl acetate is prepared from phenol and acetyl chloride. Acetyl chloride. When phenol reacts with acetyl chloride in presence of sodium hydroxide and pyridine, phenyl acetate is formed. Okay. The next reaction is reaction of phenol with benzoyl chloride. So phenol C6H5 OH is phenol and benzoyl chloride Cl CO C6H5. This is benzoyl chloride. The reaction takes place in, in presence of sodium hydroxide and pyridine. What happens? The same way. This hydrogen and this chlorine will leave as HCl. The remaining thing will be attached together. C6H5OCOC6H5. The name of this compound is phenyl benzoate. What is the name of this compound? Phenyl benzoate. Phenyl benzoate. And this is phenol. Reacts with benzoyl chloride. Sorry. Uh, yes, benzoyl chloride. In presence of sodium hydroxide and pyridine, we get phenyl benzoate. So, let's summarize the reaction. If we react phenol with benzoyl chloride in presence of sodium hydroxide and pyridine, we get phenyl benzoate. This reaction is also called as Scott and Bowman reaction. That is, the acetylation and benzoylation of phenol are called as Scott and Bowman reaction. This is one among the naming reaction in your syllabus. Thank you.